Hi everybody, Technoboy here, and welcome back to Metal Gear Survive. Uh, so, not too much changed um, since the last this last playthrough. I mean, uh, recording this directly after the last one, and I only just did this so that I can upgrade a few things without showing you guys. I just uh, got a bit more food, I upgraded my uh, gloves, and now we're going back into the transporter, and we are going to uh, we're going to head over the stress signal here. I think there's an inactive. There is an inactive wormhole transporter over here. We might as well do that. All right, it. First, we are going to uh, we are go going to head there. The only way we know how. Uh, tell oh, that was quicker than I thought. So we are teleported. Now, and now it's much now it's brighter. We can actually see a little bit of where we're going. Yeah, sure, walking out in the open, there's no reason why that would be a problem. Sword, what was it? Medicus Solid 4 theme. I like Medicus Solid 4. My favorite. Oh, damn it! Too much distracted my love of Medicus Solid. Seems like a safe way to go. Worked out very well. Okay, what we got around here then? I 
to find a way that I can probably get away with this, as long as I am careful. Computer. Never really thought that much about how these heroes can just carry so much stuff on them, and yet, and yet, yet it doesn't seem to to be there. Maybe you want to go over there? over there. Yeah, you'll never know now. Keep an eye on the remaining oxygen. Captain, supply yourself with oxygen by using Kuban energy. You can supply yourself with oxygen from your eye droid. You know, I have been messing around a bit too much. So let's go ahead and Story. Oh. One more tire. Okay, you can't get that one He's right in the fire. Just a moment. There is a vehicle near the helicopter. It appears to be an ambulance. I see it. It seems as though they've arrived here. Isn't that the the guys who are the enemies in I guess like five? There's a lot of them down there. I cannot get to there without going through that lot. I do not have a Molotov cocktail. Do I have enough to make one though? Hang on a second, I'll be right back. Yes, I can actually craft the Molotov Cocktail. Nice. Oh, I can also make a mine too. That's neat. And back into the dust. Okay, now that we got all that sorted, I think I have a good plan of attack to deal with all the zombies out there. Basically, it does involve that Molotov cocktail. Oop. Wanderer. Wanderer is the wrong place. And I just can't help but wander into trouble. Alright, 
Now that I have a whole bunch of lots of cocktails, all I need to do is round up all the zombies that they'll least to respond. Not too surprising. Okay, I can have this right now. A bit slower. It was a little bit slower than the the axe. Well, it's the job done. Okay. All these guys down here. Group them all up like this. Group up most of them. This is actually one of my favorite tactics to use. New zombie crowd control. Bring them together. And oh, crap, they spied me. That's it, go help, help your friends. Because it means you can all burn together. You can burn together. I bought a second. Perfect zombie crowd control. Okay, time for some more fast forwarding. And that's the last of them. Now to get up there. Oh. There's someone. If the target dies, the mission will have been for nothing. Please consider the oh. target's safety as well. Give her anything to help her out. Damn. More my oxygen than needs hurry. Wow. 
I waste a lot of Kuvan energy. Stop picking up stuff, just go. Come back and get all this later. Is this working? It is. That's good. Oh, no, it isn't. I just drop her like that? Come on. I pick her up first. And then we travel back home. Wait, is she really dressed like a traditional nurse? Not like a paramedic or anything like that? you out that What's helped kill you and we got an achievement Miranda. oh yeah I remember it was just like any other night I was out on a call with the doctor when we lost contact with the hospital we drove back as fast as we could but the hospital was on fire and if that wasn't hard enough to believe, a moment later, there was a light in the sky. It sucked our ambulance into it with us in it. Somehow, we survived, but then the doctor started acting... <laughs> Saying it out loud, it all sounds so ridiculous. Like any of that actually happened, right? No, what you experienced actually happened. I saw the same thing in the sky. And I was here, just like you. Where is here? They call it Dite. To put it simply, it's a world in another dimension. A world destroyed by some unknown parasite. W wait, unknown parasite? So. When the doctor looked different and attacked me after we got here... Yeah. We call humans that get infected by it wanderers. And there's no cure? Well... One cure. Just stick something really sharp in their heads. Apparently not. Once you end up like that, you're just a living corpse. Only thing you can do for him is kill him. That goes for your friends, too. You're sure about that? You guys don't look like doctors to me. Maybe a team of specialists could... 
If anyone could have done something about this, this place would still be standing, wouldn't it? Maybe they just lack certain advances in medicine. And like you said, they're still living. Perhaps if we try to communicate with them, with a little persistence, we can get through to them. They don't even have ears. How can you communicate with them? Look, your ridiculous theories are an insult to every one of them we've had to put down. I'm trying to take some moral high ground will do jack squat for you here. If you want to stay alive, keep quiet and do what we tell you. Without morals, we're no different from them. Take off your shirt. What? You're injured, aren't you? Your breathing is off. You might have a fractured rib. I should take a look at you. You know, she seems to be taking the situation rather well. What are you waiting for? If you want to stay alive, keep quiet and do what I tell you. Snap. Crew management not available. Established the base development team. Farming not available. Okay, so we can now actually grow our own food. That's a good thing. <sighs> Alright. So we now got a nurse. It's it's strange that she looks like the kind of uh typical nurse you'd see in in like a cartoon or something like that. To make effective use of our labor source, you should assign crew members to units. Come and assign crew members here. Okay. Crew management. Assigning crew members to units will ensure base camp runs more smoothly. Assign crew members as the situation warrants. Okay, so this is where it may comes a bit more like uh, things like Peace Walker. Name is a rank. Let's keep this on how high the rank. Team's rank is dependent based on the number of crew assigned to it and the aptitude of each crew for the team. Choose the crew towards their team depends on their condition and past work history. Try switching up a team's formation if it's not performing to your expectations. Right, so. Reeve. So we've got Reeve and Miranda. It's development of. Okay, so these guys are not assigned, so. But you in base development and what's the email there? You in base development. There is one item to report. When we scanned the area around the location where you rescued that woman, we detected a new memory board. We've added this information to the situation report. Okay, that's good. Uh, right, well, I guess they both do have to go there because there's no other, no other way to go. Thank you. That helped. So you really both just gonna stand funny here doing nothing? This is the team I've got to work with here. Okay, so I guess we'll stop the episode here. I'm going to just explore a bit more of the things that I've gathered, things I've learnt. Uh, maybe go around and pick up a couple more things. I think there was a few things here that I still need to get a hold of. Uh, I think I'll even grab that memory board uh, off camera. And then bring it back, and we we'll start the episode. We we'll start the next episode from there. Uh, strong Cuban crystal reaction detected. Maybe I'll look at that. Um, 
I'm not sure. Still having a lot of fun, still exploring stuff. But now we have a... I think we now can build a farm so I can start growing my own food. Right, but, um, yeah, thanks again for watching, guys. Uh, again, feedback is always important if there's anything that could help that could help me out to make this uh, even better then just uh, just message me in the comments it's the only way I'm gonna learn again thank you so much for watching I will see you next time thank you that helped you're welcome Miranda